In this video, I'm going to show you how to add additional slides in your video demo projects. Okay, so video demo is actually one of the coolest features in Adobe Captivate. It allows you to create your own little movies, your screen capture movies, of various procedures that you might want to share with your e-learning projects. But as you'll probably notice, there really isn't a traditional film strip, and there certainly isn't the ability to add uh, additional slides to a video demo project. So I got a message from Raja who asked, is there a way to add title slides and end slides in a video demo? And uh, so Raja, we, we have a solution for that. Let me take you through the, the workflow that will help you produce exactly what you're looking for here. So here's an example of a video demo, a really short one that I created. It's got a couple of pan and zooms and that's about it. Um, basically, it's just teaching you how to translate from one language to another in Microsoft Word. But I'd like to have a title slide at the beginning of it and maybe some additional slides afterwards. So the key thing is, is that you want to click on the file drop down menu and save as. Now, when you take a, a video demo project and save it, it's going to save it not to the traditional CPTX file that we're all familiar with, but instead to a CPVC format. I'm just going to save this to my desktop here. We're just going to call that Word Demo and I'll click save at this point here. And I can actually now close this project and return to my regular Adobe Captivate project. So let's say I've got this as my title slide. Now all I need to do is import my CPVC project as a slide that works within a regular CPTX project. So you'll see in the insert dropdown menu, an option for CPVC slide. And this will open that project. We'll just navigate to my desktop here. There's Word Demo. And we'll click on Open. And you can see there is my actual video demo. Uh, in this case here, the sizing of my video demo didn't match my size of my project, which is something I'd probably recommend for you to do. But uh, of course, you can customize the background and maybe make a, a solid fill, make it black or whatever other color that you wish. But now we're pretty much good to go. So we have our title slide and we have our video demo and you can add whatever slides that you wish after this. If you thought this video was useful, please like and share with your colleagues. If you need help with your next e-learning project, hire me. My focus is to create effective e-learning that achieves your business goals. Visit my website at CaptivateTeacher.com and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.